Greetings and salutations again, everyone. Welcome back to more Pokemon Coliseum. Previously, we defeated Duke in our second attempt. Well, actually, he defeated himself, which was really annoying. And we also obtained the Time Flute. This episode, after a liberated Battle Tower, of course, we're going to make our way back to a gate village because I believe that's where we need to go. We were told to go to the gate village. We might have to go back to Pyrite Town and talk to Juki. Because he's the one that warned us in the beginning. But we'll see. Ah, yeah, we had to go back here. Yeah, just gotta make sure that Egan knows that Yuki's okay. Liberated Mount Battle. But now we can receive emails from Egan. Basically, it's a way to advance the story. But we have our objective to go to the Time Forest and use the Time Flute to summon Celebi. Which I said in the previous episode, the time blue, it allows you to purify a Pokemon instantly. No if, ands, or buts, you use it, Shadow Pokemon's purified no matter what it is. There's multiple time flutes in the game, and I'd recommend using them on Pokemon you get near the end of the game. Oh yeah, we have to actually use the item. We'll use the Time Flute on Man Time, I think. Instantly purified, which is great. We gain to move win attack and zero XP. Using the time free does not give your Pokemon any XP whatsoever, even if they've been in like a hundred battles. It's unfortunate, but that's how it is because you're obviously not putting in the effort to have to shadow Pokemon open the door to the start. But that's basically a time free. Just more in the game, so don't worry. I believe we have to talk to Egan now. I'll also get another Shadow Pokemon from the PC, because why not? Oh, yeah, I should have purified my troops and that. I kind of forgot if I'm being honest. Also in the previous episode, I decided that my time is going to be on my team, even though it's going to have a contradicting type on my team, but it's, it works so well with Meganium. Like, I just can't refuse to get the option to be able to use Waze Leaf and stuff like that. It's brilliant. Okay, now we're, where are we going to go now? Hmm. I think they might actually want us to go to Mount Battle, I'm not sure. I don't remember having to go to Mount Battle. Oh yeah, we have the mystery lab. I don't think we can go here though. I'm pretty sure it's the front gate. Oh, we have an email. We got one from... We have a PR nabbed, duking up Pyrite Town. 
We just had a pair of goons. We think we take orders from Mirror B. We both screen some uh, for some intelligence. The police have had them in jail. It's going to it's going to Pirate Town in a hurry. We have our goal. We need to go to Pirate Town. Obviously, there's a gate here. We can't go for it. We can't go for the electric fence or laser fence, which laser fence is pretty cool. So I don't want to check. Do you have a meeting again? How should we feel? Let me see. Yeah. We have the option to battle Kale again. So I'm going to try to catch the lightning he has. Or not the lightning. Cut. As you can see, they have a Kale at level 40, which should be a God of War by now. I guess because it'd be too friendly to fight a God of War at this moment. Body Slam, Curlia, and Shadow Watch on Fair. Even though Fair is going to move super quick, it's probably going to hit Metatite and then one shot it. Because Metatite has really bad defense. Metatite's in hyper mode, but it's going to get KO'd right now. As for the next Pokemon I send out, I'm going to send out Yamma. I swap the XP ship from Espeon to um, Marsh. Alright, let's go for a Weasley. The Sonic Boom on Curlia. Let's see how that goes. Here's a new Pokeo curly, that much is that much is obvious. And first gonna take a fair amount of hits. Not too shabby. And now he's a no sleep. Just put it. Go for the body slam on Ferret. Sonic Boom. On Nuzleaf. Alright, go to Dunsparce. And we're going to have to heal after this battle as well. That's great. I shadow wash on those leaf. We'll probably make an attempt to catch from it now. to a ball I think on fit and we'll hold on spots. There we go, comfort. Now what to do with the choke? The rest of the battle should not be bad at all. So actually, I'm going to cut to the end of the battle because it's nine. It's we're nearly at ten minutes for the episode already. So I'll see you guys then. Battle one. 
Last Pokemon Kale had was a Machoke, I think. Did you guys see? They got one shot. But now we'll head to the jail. I'll heal once we get to the once we have to go to the next objective. The suspects we arrested haven't spilled any beans in our favor. We're gonna afraid of payback from the organization. Wait, West was it? Your PDA number. Enemy of these two. Actually, I get away from me. I have no way to get in there. I could go talk to this officer. Unfortunately, we don't have anything that can be used to open that. I think we should talk to your chief again, maybe? Strange. I think we might have to go to the fortune teller? I'm not quite sure. Or maybe have to talk to Juki. He might tell us something. Yeah, that's uh keep getting confused with these buildings. <laughs> Alright, okay. <laughs> Might be a situation we had to talk to the chief, I'm not quite sure. That's not telling us anything. Get back to that creaky old building with Nadu on the spot. I think that's where we have to go. I think it's where we had. I think it's where we may have been his old base. I think we have to go there and just like an item we can get. Did they may have just dropped something? You never know. And transfer the balance again. Well, I'm gonna jump cut and figure out where I have to go. Okay, I searched up there, and this is the desk you have to go to. The jokey is just on there glowing, I didn't notice it for some reason. The site that I went to, it said the chief desk, so it, said, it basically said it was here. So, again, it's another site giving me useless information. We want to use the jail key on this. Yeah, and we have to steal the key from this person. And we can also open these other doors, but there's not exactly any reason to. And now we can go for the lab. I had she's on a terminal. Which makes sense. Oh, wait. It's actually an elevator. Never mind. Suppose I actually go back to Pirate Town. Before we do, uh, I'm gonna buy some more Pokeballs. Might as well get them when you can. Let's just see what we got. 
We have access to auto balls now, which is great. Timer balls, nest balls, but obviously, oh. Yeah, I might as well actually just keep the money. Well, if how's it even against what? Unfortunately, it's not an easy money grind in this game. I think there's an amulet coin we can get at some point. But even with the amulet coin, there's only so many battles you have to go you can go to. And I don't think you get money from Mount Battle, which is a bit of a shame. If you did, then the amulet coin would be great there. There's one easy money farm, but it's post game. That's not even exactly a good one. The door is locked. Well, use the elevator key. I mean, that train in battles for something. I think you have to talk to her though. But I'm gonna big old elevator saying down. Welcome to the underground. Or under. Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it's time for the under time again. Now for further ado, let's bring out the special song we've all been waiting for, Lady Venus. That was Lady Venus. Yeah, basically. Nah, they were fine, Yuki. But they know basically over here, I guess. And this is basically a whole underground town that was created by uh, Cypher. It's gotta be on my way or on my way. I'm gonna say yes. I want to see what happens if you say no. Right, you don't look like space to me. Despite the fact we're the people that keep the same keeps getting warned about. You want a shop? I think it's actually another Pokeball shop. No, but there's a lot of stuff you can buy here. You can buy a TM10 Hidden Power. You can buy a Blizzard Hyper Beam. Nice screen. Protect. Um, I don't remember the name of it. A mystical veil. Um, I don't remember the name of it. Protect the target with a thunderbolt, which is a thunderbolt. This creates this is one of this reflect. Um, fire blast effect, flamethrower. I mean, there's one I want to actually get. Which is... Protect. So it's a good thing I didn't buy Ultra Balls. Otherwise I wouldn't be able to get it. wonder if Pokemon on my team would actually benefit highly from Protect. And that Pokemon... It's terror. By a large shot. And a move I'm Oh, it's a tricky one. I'm going to move body slam now. Now I'm thinking of teaching a toxic, but I'm not going to. I thought maybe help me gain your B. So toxic the opponent and spam protect a bunch. But I, I like it having Sunny Day because then if it has Sunny Day it can use Solar Beam later on because it can learn Solar Beam. So come quick. This year a safer admin named to Kim was beaten down. As the second admin, admin to go after me, a baby enemy must be pretty strong. Well, Dugan didn't kill himself. We have three hyper potions. Very generous of the game, even though none of our Pokemon have 200 HP so far. 
That's it. In here is basic coach health. You can get healed here, but there's also a Pokemon Center, I believe. Yeah. Oh. Enjoy much skills I've been under again, leave Venus. Yeah, this, I think this is actually the Pokemon Center. It looks like it, but you have to pay for the Pokemon Center here. Oh, and we have a battle. Well, this is a good time to test out Protect. Or not, because they have Magikarp and Phoebus. Two water Pokemon who... Well, they're sort of joke. Well, they're joke fish Pokemon, but they become incredibly brilliant Pokemon later on. They become a Gyarados and a Malato and a Malotech. But they only know Splash. Which won't do anything, I think, if Wayne Dance is in effect, it makes one Pokemon swap place with the other. So if you're attacking Magikarp and you Splash to swap place with Phoebus, I think you would attack Phoebus instead, I'm not sure. I'm probably warned about that. Pretty sure Wayne Dance just does nothing. And look at that, they got a Waylord. I'm pretty sure Waylord does evolve to level 41. Let's just see. A Willman evolves at level 40, so that's fine. It's really just a Willman, it's just evolved. The Willow's taking a good bit of damage. And she's a strength. That is good. Okay, Matt, I lived through that. The wheel's not gonna get KO'd at that way. Unless it hits itself. Do you chance it? Oh, yeah, look at how giant wheel it is as well. Just a behemoth. There we go. Go Willow. Well. Good XP as well. Maybe not. 400 for such. Strange. Okay, Henry. There's a couple of trainers to battle around here. If here's my grandchild, we see join something called the Kids Squid. This time they get to spin that possibly so dissipated from the shop. Yeah, one of the kids in Juking's place is actually a grandchild of someone from the under. It's basically a saboteur. I got a power pot. So now we gotta find someone called Pear. Oh! Venus, what is your situation? Well, a couple of mice appeared to be wanting loose that score, but there's nothing to worry about. We'll catch them right away, pulverize and mash them up. And the road is to distribute shadow Pokemon, don't forget. As few act <laughs> Hurry, complete the shadow Pokemon's development as soon as possible. Trust will not be misplaced, Master Nascor. Already sufficient shadow Pokemon battle there has been gathered from our minions. 
the most powerful Shadow Pokemon in history shall be ready. Objective, so we'll hopefully find her soon enough. Now, in the under there is the PC. I would recommend just using the PC healing map because I think they charge you a lot of money just to heal. This is about. It's supposed to be different for signal. to your skin. A little while ago, we somehow lost access to the kids' squid. Being caused by jamming signals into fading with the kids' squid. It's probably Venus. Nothing. I'm just looking about seeing if there's like an item or something. But then where are we supposed to go after this? Yuki, move. I explained a while ago to my last access to the kids' group. I think it was called by jam signal. Okay, I think we just leave that. There you go, we have a PDA number. I think we actually have to enter the Colosseum? The spy, we spy the spy. Okay. So a spy. Look over there, find the elevator, we finally found a spy. And there's silver. Hard again as usual. <coughs> yep, I'm here to ask him. So now we have four bells to go through. It's like a PR cloak. Shadow Pokemon being the Ledian. I believe this is the first repeat of a Shadow Pokemon we can catch now. Oh, that was even fun. I don't have anything. Yeah, Manatai was getting knocked out. No matter what happened, I didn't heal it. I didn't think it was necessary. So we'll set down Marsh. Because they kind of need to do damage, and they have not to do damage to the world. <laughs> so 
I'm gonna go with Protect as so. Safeguard, that's what we were thinking of that was in the shop. <coughs> and Volpe's using double team. Critical hit, but it did nothing. It's going to damage. Oh my god. We're not doing any damage. Uh, try for Razor Lee. A slam, maybe? I might have to do some training about battle, to be honest. Does more damage, but will be in a bit of a situation where I can't, where, where I can't dodge his. Basically, to, to can just get Ledian by itself, and I can hit it. Shadow wishes to take Craig's there, which is good. Will be using Confused Way, but Terra obviously protected itself. This opportunity to heal. Easily a surf combo. Little beam. I'm making Quagsire or Marsh. Nope, do it for Terra because it's super effective. See, we had Ladian. Or Ladian. Ladian. We won't be avoid the attack, but now we'll add the serve. It's just hoping that I have won't be. Need to KO as soon as possible. That is good. Safeguard fading. This is why I'm gonna have Terra use attack, then go for a serve. Going for a quick and easy KO, which makes sense. Legend might be in KO wing. Well, if we get a crit, it'll be in KO range, but I might catch wave, like catch range. Try to do is try and catch Ledian now. We can use Great Ball and go for Slam on Spinarak. Ledian is caught. Fantastic. Okay, we won this. Spinnaker will probably just KO Ganyu, because it wants to get KO quickly. That gives us an opportunity to send out Yanma. Go for Sonic Boom and Slam. Tiny bit where we've been at battle. 
because if Lenin decided to be annoyed and not be caught, then I probably would have lost. Spy is actually strong. Does the spy should be? Hope to hear you see a bell with accent protection. Oh uh, yeah. Two bells and we don't get a heal. Every dose and glue. <clears throat> Could be a little bit worried. We have four Pokemon, I think? Yeah, we have four. So we're gonna go for Cybermon Gloom and. Ooh. Go with Glare on Ariados. Handy. Basically, a guaranteed Blouses for his. I call Blouses for his, actually. I think it's a good accuracy compared to the others. Let's see, we'll go for Swift and Shadow Wash on every dose. Low enough. It can learn yarn, which can be useful. I mean, compared to one shot, maybe, but I'm not gonna learn yarn. Now we're gonna go for Cyber One Area Dose and Shadow Wash on Elements. Illumise, or Illumise. Super effective. And Silver Wind. Just great. Super effective on SBR, which is kind of annoying. And Dunce Pass is in Hyper Mode. We'll go for the Side Beam and Call Dunce Pass. Unfortunately, SPR is getting here at this turn. But SPR is a. Well, actually, SPR is on level with anything else. It's not that SPR is over level. Terra and Marsh are under level. That's the issue. I'm asking a KO to someone like that thing. So I'm gonna go for the slam. And just heal up. Ooh, shockwave, okay. Kind of cool. Flatter, it's like the move Swagger, but it means your special attack confuses you. Which I guess that means Don's Pass is a higher special stat? According to the game? Or it just wants Don's Pass confused for some reason? Released both of us. And the thing is that if you do have Quillab in it, I found this super easy. 
You just one shot if you have. Can we unlock the door? Nope. I think I'm going to talk to Silver though. the ore disc. Well, we have a new item to test out. I'm going to heal and end this episode here. Next time, we'll be going through the rest of the under. I'll see you guys then.